Hi, I'm Mariela. Welcome back. I want to thank all of my subscribers. This has been an amazing ride. And I'm now ready to begin making more beautiful creations. Again, thank you for all your support. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful necklace. It matches with the twisted diamond earrings. I always like to make projects projects that are going to match, they're going to go together. So that's why I come up with this idea. To make this necklace, you're going to have to watch two of my previous videos. I'm going to post um, the link on the description box. It's the twisted diamond earrings and the falling tears necklace. On the falling tear necklace, I use twin beads and 11 or seed beads. For this one, I use super duos and 15 or seed beads. The materials are going to be the same ones that are going to be posted on each video. You're going to have to make 11 of these components. I'm going to put all the information in the description box of how many crystals you're going to need to um, put on each of these components. You're going to need 98 3 millimeter crystals and you're going to need a clasp of your choice, 11 accent beads. These ones are 12 by 8 drops, but you can use anything that you like. Um, On this video, I'm just going to show you how to put it together. So if you like this necklace, uh, be sure you want to um, watch the two videos that I mentioned. And um, read the description box because in the description box, I'm going to tell you how many crystal each of these component has. You have to make two of each and then the centerpiece. And the first one, you're not going to need any... Um, crystals. You're just going to do a row of Peugeot stitch, which it should be pretty simple to make. And um, I think that will be it for this um, tutorial. Once again, I thank you all of my subscribers. And um, if you're not my subscriber yet, please subscribe. And I hope you're going to like this tutorial and you're going to make this beautiful necklace the steps are the same you're gonna fold your necklace in half you're gonna mark the super duo in the center you're gonna skip that one and then you're gonna count 16 and you want your thread exit out of the 16 I already um, add this ones, so I'm just gonna show you really quick how you're gonna add them. And this one, my thread was exit out of this um, super duo. And what I'm going to do next is the same steps I did this one. My thread is exit out of this one. I'm going to pick up two 15s, super duo, and three 15s. You want to bring them down. You want to pass your needle through this, through the delicas too. It doesn't matter how many you go, you can go as many as you want. I'm going to go down one more. And 
then I'm gonna go through the one across my thread is exit out of this one I'm gonna pass my needle going up through this this one right here and I'm gonna go up through the 15 I skip one right here. Up through this delica. And up through the 15. And then we're gonna go Pass our needle through the first 15 of these three we add. We just want to pass through one and pull. Pick up two 15s and pass your needle through the other hole of the Super dual and pull. Pick up two fifteens a skip one. Our thread was exit out of this one. We're gonna skip one, go through the next one. Through the fifteen and through one more. So you're gonna actually pass your needle through two super duos. And we have one more add. So we're just gonna continue doing the same steps. That's the same way you're gonna um, do all this. That's why I go ahead and did this. So remember you, um, mark your necklace half count 16 you want you a thread exit out of the 16th and then you're gonna do these steps that I just show you I'm gonna do it one more time you wanna pick up two 15s super duo and three 15s Gonna pick up another one and we're gonna come down to come down one more Pass your needle across the delica up through this delica and now through the fifteen. And up through the first fifteen of the three that we have right here. And we're gonna pull that. We're gonna pick up two fifteens and go up through the other hole of the twin bead. Pick up two fifteens. Our thread is exit out of this twin bead. We're gonna skip one and go through the next one, through the fifteen, and through one more.
and you want to continue doing this with the thread that you have left right here this ones just go ahead and reinforce all this by going up and down through our beads and cut them and uh, do the same with all the threads that you have left like I have one another one right here from my necklace go ahead and do that and I'll be right back to show you my necklace I'm done adding all my um, pieces together all I gotta do now is um, make some knots reinforce with my threads that I have right here and I'll be done with my necklace.